In this video, I'm gonna show you all about how to attach your tack vent to your ballistic vest. Hey, what's going on, MC? Uh, coming to you live from MCPD. I am holding in my hand my tack vent, and if uh, you'll remember, last week I unboxed this sucker, and today I'm gonna show you how easy it is to attach it to your body armor. Eventually it's gonna sit uh, yeah, about like that on your chest, except there will be a, uh, you know, things that'll stop you from getting shot right in front of you. So why don't you follow me along over here. You'll notice that I've got my ballistic vest here on the table, and then you've got the Velcro patches that come with the tack vent. Uh, in my particular shipment, I also received a iron-on uh, version, I guess you could say, but I think these are gonna work well. So here's the trick. You want it up, not not above the, uh, the neckline here. You don't want it poking you, so this would be uncomfortable. So somewhere about in this neighborhood, uh, I've already tried it on without affixing it. Uh, right, belt lines right about here. You'll notice it does hang off over the edge of the vest, and you'll simply just uh, take a sharp implement, simmers, sis, simmers, scissors, what have you, and ride along the line there. So what I'm gonna do is simply roll this back Gonna take the uh, Velcro off, and on the back here is the sticky portion. So I pull this top bit off, roll that over, and that is all set. I'm gonna go ahead and do that for all of these, and then you'll see me put it on. All right, I'm gonna cut that little sucker off. Now you'll notice, again, it hangs over the edge of the, the vest. I will adjust that at a later date. But for now, throw this over my head. Secure it. And I gotta say, it is I can feel it, it is not uncomfortable. Even if, honest to God, even if I were to leave this here, uh, I don't know that it would be that big of a deal. I, I do wear shirts that are designed to go under the body armor that, that are very comfortable. But uh, if I get rid of this part right here, you can see, actually, can you, can you see down there the, uh, the corrugation of the tack vent? And that's gonna allow the, the air to come up and out that will cool me off uh, by about an average of 14 and a half degrees body surface temperature. Tomorrow I will be 10.8. I will be uh, wearing this, it's gonna be probably the mid 90s. So I am looking forward to seeing how the next couple of weeks go. Uh, if you wanna get your own tack vent, simply go to tackvent.com and uh, you can enter the code MC10, that's MC10. It's an affiliate link and uh, you'll get 10% off and all good, I get a few bucks on the side, but really it, it doesn't hurt you at all. You get a benefit, you're gonna be cooler. Uh, my motor officers are gonna know what I'm talking about. Being on the bike in the summertime is brutal. 10 by 10 is a thing for a reason. That's 10 tickets by 10 a.m. So far, I'm feeling very comfortable. Uh, I'm looking forward to it. I will give you an update in a week or two and let you know how tack vent is working. As this is going to be airing, I believe we're still running our tack vent giveaway in conjunction with the launch of my latest podcast, What's Your Emergency? If you want to enter to win your own tack vent, go to wyeradio.com slash tack vent, and you can enter by doing a myriad of things, including subscribing to the podcast, following tack vent, myself, or the happy medic on Facebook, Twitter, you can watch my unboxing video. You'll actually get points for watching this video. So until then, this is MC signing off from MCPD. Cheers and thanks to Jeff Shelton and TacVent.